I'm in control of like whether or not I subscribe to that case or not. So I can look at my subscriptions and add myself or remove myself as I want to do that. So I'm going to go ahead and show you those search options and then that subscription option. There is a quick search if I knew what the case number was and I was just interested in that one particular case. I could use that quick search by just putting in the case number and it would pull up a case that looked very similar to this. And you can see that there's that subscribe button right there whenever I'm in a case. So that's one way to subscribe. Um, or I could go to advanced search, which is kind of a more robust search. Um, I can search for cases or I can search for documents. And I'm going to pull up that case. Yep. So I have searched for uh, that case number. And, I'm, you know, based on my search uh, criteria, I presented with the list of options. And if I uh, find the option that I'm interested in, I can just simply click subscribe here from the list.